The ability to pump your bike's tires quickly and accurately should be a staple of your cycling equipment collection. A good floor bike tire pump is a must-have item for every cyclist. Our guide video on the 10 best bike pump has all the choices you could hope for. We've included quite a few types of bike pumps, so pay attention and pick the one best suited for your needs. If you are using any of the bike pumps, then what is your opinion on it? Let me know in the comments. Number 10. Fosen Bike Pump. Are you searching for the best bike pump, then look at the Fosen Bike Pump. It is one of the best bike pumps on the market. This pump comes with a 160 psi pressure gauge that accurately displays tire pressure to ensure that the tire pressure is just right. You can choose whether to continue to inflate, which makes the pressure of tires proper. The pedal of this bike foot pump has a good slip resistance by serrated surface texture. It's easy to inflate your bicycle tires, spend less effort and time. It also has good heat resistance and antifreeze. This pump also comes with a high quality sealing ring and flexible tube, which make it can be used normally in winter and summer. The size of a water glass and it weighs 400 G. If you are going to ride a long distance, it will be a great option with the mini pump. It fits Presta and Schrader valve, free ball needle and gas needle, which can be used for bicycles, motorcycles, electric cars, sports balls, balloons, inflatable dolls, swimming rings, hovercraft, etc. Number 9. Airgun X1000 Bike Pump. This is a great high-quality bike pump that is able to pump out a maximum of 160 psi. The Airgun X1000 bike pump includes a premium-grade pressure valve that can fit on both Presta and Schrader valves. It even has a pressure release valve so you release air if you pump too much in. The psi monitor is fully adjustable as well so you know exactly how much pressure you're pumping. Plus, it's easy to read due to its large circular design. It even includes all of the necessary needles to pump up sports balls and tires as well. The barrel is designed out of sturdy steel, so it holds together under pressure. Plus, it comes with a clip so you can keep the hose off the ground. One drawback is that it is in the higher price range for bike pumps, but it feels like it should be lower. Not to say its construction is lacking, but it is a steep price for a bike pump. You may also run into issues with the size of the valve head, as it may not fit through certain sized spokes. Number 8. Hoppa Pro Portable Bike Pump. The unique portable bike pump from Hoppa Pro can be mounted on your mountain bike, road bike, ordinary bicycle, etc. Its upgraded solution makes this pump portable to carry the pump via an extra silicon foam bracket. This bike pump is made of aluminum alloy materials, which are more durable and compact than plastic ones. The structure is well designed and user-friendly, such as the anti-slip base and pedal, replaceable freeze, and heat-resistant tube. It comes with a hand and foot activated design that makes pumping much easier and faster. This mini size makes it easier to be carried or mounted on the bicycle. The upgraded design valve is well compatible with Presta, Schrader, Dunlop valves, which are not only for bikes, but also for electric vehicles, motorcycles, or even a car. It also comes with an extra gas needle and valve in the package to help pump up balls, balloons, swimming rings, inflating boats, etc.
Number 7. Topeak Joe Blow Bike Pump. This Joe Blow Bike Pump by Topeak stands out from the crowd because it's easy to use with a wide variety of bikes. It is great for smaller wheels and for wheels that may have different spoke construction. The head is unique because its locking lever is on the side of the head rather than on top, making it easier to maneuver in small places. It has Schrader valves that attach on one side of the head and Presta on the other. With a weighted, wide, two-footed base, the Joe Blow is stable during use and was one of the few pumps that didn't knock over every time we walked past it. In addition to being placed higher up on the pump, which makes it easy to read, the gauge is also the only one to include a sliding psi marker. Prior to pumping, simply slide the yellow arrow-shaped marker around the gauge until it points at your desired psi. The one downside to the Joe Blow for families is its poor needle storage. While the pump does come with a ball and bladder needle, the needle storage consists of just two slots next to the psi gauge. The needles simply rest in position and do not lock into place, so they are certain to easily get lost. Number 6. Vimalolo Bike Pump. If you are looking for the best bike pump, then look at the Vimalolo Bike Pump. It is one of the best bike pumps on the market. The inner and outer tubes of this pump are made of high-strength steel, which is more wear-resistant and has a smooth surface. And the rubber tube of the portable air pump is detachable, frost-proof, and has high temperature resistance. It also features a newly designed valve head that can easily switch between Presta and Schrader valves and without any air leaks. You don't need to buy more pumps that fit multiple valves. This pump can inflate bicycles, electric vehicles, motorcycles, cars, sports balls, and swimming rings. It also has an ergonomically designed comfortable handle, with an external booster buffer, easy to inflate, 160 psi maximum. Number 5. Pro Bike Tool Mini Bike Pump. For a good blend of price and portability, it's hard to beat the mini bike pump from Pro Bike Tool. This slick looking pump features a removable flexible hose with a Schrader valve fit on one end and a Presta valve on the other. The hose also features an integrated pressure gauge. At 7.5 inches long and under 5 ounces, it mounts onto a bike frame easily without adding a lot of weight. It will also fit easily into a pack or jersey pocket. The CNC machined aluminum body is durable and grooved for a solid grip while pumping. It also comes with multiple color options that will blend in with any bike. This pump can reach up to 100 psi with a good number of pumps. The rubber and the thread on air chucks prevent air loss. It performs well with high pressure and high volume tires, although the hand pump resistance increases greatly at higher pressures. This Pro Bike Tool Mini Bike Pump is a perfect blend of price and utility, making it the best mini bike pump we've seen yet. Number 4. Schwinn Air Center Bike Pump. Schwinn is a name synonymous with bicycles, so the Schwinn Air Center Bike Pump is a great choice for any biker. This pump features a dual easy indicator pump head that fits on both Schrader and Presta valves, making it versatile and convenient. The best feature of this bike pump is its color-coded indicator that lets you know when the valve is locked in place. It comes with a wide metal base that enhances its stability, so it won't fall over on you while you're pumping up your tires. The hose measures 38 mm long with a high-volume steel barrel that is 21 inches long. It is also capable of pumping up to 120 psi with its easy-to-grip handle that is also comfortable. However, you may end up getting a lot of resistance when pumping air into your tires. It isn't the most expensive pump either, which is typically a good thing, but that may mean it isn't as reliable as other models. The gauge also isn't the most accurate.
Number 3. Bel Air High Volume Bike Pump. If you're an avid cyclist then you know the name Bell. This Bel Air High Volume Bike Pump looks great for a simple pump and stands out in your garage with its bright yellow color. It comes with a dual Schrader and Presta pump head for added convenience and is easy to pump with its oversized handle. This pump works great on all types of bicycles including mountain, cruiser, hybrid, BMX, and even kids' bike tires. It can pump a maximum of 100 psi as well and features a large gauge monitor at the bottom of the pump that is easy to see and read. The barrel is constructed out of strong steel and the hose can easily hang alongside the pump with its included clips. One of the negative aspects of this pump is its maximum of 100 psi is on the lower end so you won't be getting a lot of pressure with each pump. The hose is also on the shorter side, and the valve head may be too large for scooters or wheels with smaller spokes. Number 2. The Brelli Bike Pump. This mini bike pump from Vibrelli is a great choice if you plan on long rides or want to reduce weight while traveling. The pump is lightweight and compact, so it can be packed away in a backpack or maybe even in your bike storage bag. It is able to pump up to 120 psi and is easy to use as well. All you have to do is pump the extendable telescope until you reach your desired psi. This pump can also easily switch from high volume to high pressure when necessary. It locks onto both Presta and Schrader valves automatically, so you don't have to fuss with it. However, the best part is its accessibility, as this bike pump can attach directly to your bike with Velcro straps. However, you will notice an issue with this minuscule pump when compared to others. Due to its smaller size, it will require a bit more power and pumps to reach a preferable size level. This can be a larger issue for mountain bikers as the tires will require more air, so be prepared to spend a bit of time with the tool. Number 1. BV Bicycle Ergonomic Bike Pump. The Bicycle Ergonomic Bike Pump by BV is our top choice. While it may not have a super recognizable brand name, it gets the job done. Matching most of the features of more expensive options like 160 psi capability, this pump stacks up well for considerably less money. This pump's value is in the features you're getting for the considerably lower price. The tube is steel, providing durability and strength, but is still considerably lighter than our best overall pick. It also has an easy-to-read large gauge that is large with a highly visible face, and it's placed above the base for easy reading. This pump will also work with Presta, Schrader, and Dunlop valves. The barrel of this pump is made of steel, and the whole construction is relatively solid even if it contains many plastic parts. So when inflating high pressures, you will feel the pump is not as sturdy as full metal pumps. Overall, this is a good entry-level pump for the money. It does its job well, and you can rely on it. That's it for today. If you like our video then a sub will be awesome. Here are the top 10 bike pump on the market for you. Hope you found what you are looking for. So don't forget to leave a comment and don't forget to like and subscribe.